Hello everybody, this is Rick Unser here with Ergon Web and Ergon Web TV. And today is the day we're finally going to take the new Gambo Big Bore rifles to the range. I've got all four here. We've shot all four. They all did really well. Stay with us, we'll be right back. So let's go ahead and get started here. We've got two different sets of guns. We've got the Winchester guns and we've got the Gamo guns. The Winchester guns are multi-shot, magazine-fed, big bore. We have in 35 and 45 caliber. The Gamo guns, these are the Gamo TC guns. These are single shot. We have in 35 and 45 caliber. Let's talk a little bit about performance. Now you guys have been seeing the videos. I've already given you the numbers there. We're gonna kind of do a recap on that anyway. So let's take a look. This is here, the 45. Okay, so the 45 Winchester. You're looking at shooting the 138 grain, 100 supply pellets out of this. Now those were developed. See, I went out there to 100 supply and took some pre-production models and we started playing with something that would really go well with these guns, would feed smoothly in the magazine, would give us the velocity we need for the lethality in a gun like this and also give us the accuracy. Those pellets do it, 138 grain, pushing over 800 feet per second. This is yielding 197 plus or minus foot pounds. Now the beauty is, the way we've got these guns set up is that we wanted reasonable shot count with that power, with that accuracy. So unlike other big bore guns where every shot just drops so dramatically, we're getting five shots, that's the magazine, at right around 12 to 15 feet per second spread on this gun. That's right at 195 to 197, 190 something foot pounds consistently accurate out of this gun. Now today we were able to shoot at 35 yards because the range as you can hear is quite busy today. We managed to get our favorite little spot down here. Did limit us to 35 yards, don't worry. As soon as I get a chance to get back out to Texas, we're going to stretch these out to really see what they can do at longer ranges. But today you guys at least get an idea of what we're getting at 35 yards. Now we're gonna move on over to the 35 cal Winchester. This gun really wanted this to be that predator, small deer, uh, you know, something that had a little more shot count and kept the consistency. So we're getting two mags out of this with really good consistency out of this gun. Uh, 10 shots is right in that oh, 30 or 40 foot per second. If you stretch it to 12 full shots, it does climb a little bit, but really what you're getting is a solid two mags out of this gun at that 130-ish foot-pound range. That's completely acceptable for like coyote, small pigs, small deer, etc. Now, the cool thing about this is we're running the JSB pellets today for our accuracy tests, but this magazine is deep, so you can use other ammo options. So there's many different cast ammos that you can run in this gun. I've found the 0.358s really to be very good. If you go less than that, it kind of slops around, it's not quite as accurate. So you want to have a little bit larger, 358, maybe even 359, I haven't tested any of those yet. But I know the 358s work really good in this gun. So this gun shoots very well. This is probably going to be, you know, it's probably going to be a 100 yard Predator gun. Realistically, it's getting the velocity, it's getting the range, it definitely has the accuracy. This is going to be a great, great gun for you guys who like to go out to Predator hunt. Moving on, I'm gonna jump all the way over to this gun right here. This is the uh, Gamo TC 35, 35 cal carbine, six pounds before you put a scope on it. This gun is phenomenal. Really good high shot count out of something like this when you're shooting the lightweight, the lightweight pellets. But you can go and actually go all the way up to like the 190 grain flat point cast. So this gives you tremendous flexibility, single shot, breech loaded. If you can get it in the breech, you can shoot it with this gun. That's the very cool thing about this, this guy right here. And shot count, like I said, probably 20, 30 shots with pellets in a big bore. Pretty doggone good. This gun is really, really neat. Now we get to the big boy, the 45 cal. This guy is pushing over 400 foot pounds. Now, today we shot 
with the 350 grain cast slugs from Hunter Supply. And yeah, they did awesome. Now, with those big heavy slugs, you're not gonna get a high shot count. You're gonna get three really good shots. And then your fourth and fifth shot, as you see on the shot card, they drop. That's just the way it goes. When you're gonna max that power out, you're not gonna get high shot count. But this gives you three very consistent high power shots. And then you could easily use your mill dots to adjust if you wanted to get shots four and five on the bullseye. So as you can see here, a great offering from Gamo, great accuracy, good energy. These really, really fit, I think, what the market's looking for. The Winchester 45, I cannot wait to take this out and go pig hunting with it because 200 foot pounds, consistent power, consistent accuracy, multi-shot, very, very impressive. I've already done some hunting with a version of this gun. Uh, this is phenomenal. No, I mean, this is just a great gun. I want to take this guy out here, the 45 cal, 400 foot pounds. That's the one I really want to go and find me a big pig and see what that gun will do. So that's going to wrap up our look here at the new Gamo Big Boars. You've got the Winchesters and you've got the Gamo TCs, the Winchester Model 70, the Gamo TC, Model 35, Model 45. These guns are awesome. All of these are available right now at www.airgunproshop.com. We've got the ammo, we've got the guns, we'll get you taken care of. My name is Rick Utzler here with Airgun Web and Airgun Web TV. Thanks for watching. <laughs>